I think we just have so many good things we can accomplish, like I said before, and it really is wanting to make sure that the sport is unified as much as we can. And I know we say that over and over again, but this truly is a chance that, you know, Jeff and I have had our disagreements, but we knew moving forward that we agree on a lot of things, and we agree on 99% of everything, and we have the new board members to be able to help us along that journey, and, and we just know that this is going to be different than it has before, and we're determined to make it work. New superintendent, like I said, is turning over new lead, new central office, new you know president, new officers, new committee chairs. It's like it's a perfect storm that we won't have very often, so we're excited. We are. We're really excited. Um, any, any particular issues you want to tackle right off the bat with the biggest thing? I, guess, I think discipline is one that we know. I mean, kind of taking the lead off junior high. Discipline is one that we are going to sub a four, uh, do a committee, a subcommittee of policy um, that will be discipline made up of representatives from each school, and you know, kind of making sure we have a uniform discipline plan. Uh, Steve has a, a, you know, we we want a strategic plan. We want a vision for the next three to five years. We haven't had that in prior leadership. I mean, where are we going to be? What buildings do we want to do? You know, the building issue is another thing that we have coming up in the next two years to, with our bonds coming up. I mean, we want to build new buildings. We're working on that right away. To, to what is our redistricting plan? What is everything, you know, so um, curriculum, the core curriculum. Every committee, that's why it's very important, the committee chairs and whoever is involved, we said every committee has an important job to do that is going to be a major player in the next two years to do a lot of things to change this district completely. And even in spite of our finances, we can do a lot of things um, for the positive. So that's what we're looking forward to, a lot to do. We told the new board members it, it was they were going to hit the ground running, and there better not be any slacking because we expect them to work. So. Can you talk more about that vision? Can you talk about having a vision for the next three to five Right, years? and Steve uh, Cobb, the new superintendent, he, he, you know, right away, I mean, we, we, we've talked about things in the future, but we've never really have implemented those things. And so, um, you know, we are planning to have a board retreat, and, you know, it is, where, where do we want to be and in two years, do we want our buildings start, you know, starting to be built? Do we want, you know, redistricting? We, do do we want different campuses? You know, what do we do with the ninth graders? Do we, we you know, we want to move them over? So um, there's just a lot of we, we want the schools to be unified, as Steve says. We don't want silos. We don't want, you know, we want everyone on the same page. We want everyone doing the same curriculum, which is going to happen with core curriculum. I mean, we, we want everyone to, um, you know, just know what everyone else is doing on the same page and just uniting the whole district thinking we've got great leadership we know where we're going and this is how we're going to do it and so do I have all the answers to how or, or what but uh, no but I know that uh, we have a have a lot of things in, in our head that we would like to accomplish so